Is that right? Big series against the Kiwis. Is everyone pumped up? Yeah, I think so. We had our first training session today um, after arriving yesterday. So it was pretty intense in the nets. Um, but we'll have our main session tomorrow. And I think, um, yeah, I guess everyone will, will iron things out and, and get ready for the contest um, come, come later this week. Looking forward to playing some 50 over cricket after so much big bash and World T20 everything this summer? Yeah, it feels like we've probably spent the last six months just playing T20 cricket, so it'll be nice to play a, a longer format. And yeah, I think the girls are really looking forward to getting out there and um, just being able to spend a little bit more time in the middle with the bat and, and the bowlers bowling some longer spells. I think you've held the trophy since year, the year 2000. How confident are you being able to extend that? Oh, we'd love to, but by no means do we want to underestimate New Zealand either. They've got some really dangerous players and, um, you know, we've seen that even over the, the last little bit in the series we had prior to Christmas in, in T20s. They've um, got some, yeah, some really key players who can take the game away from you. So, yeah, we want to finish our season really well too. We, we've had, um, you know, pretty good little period. Um, so it'd be nice to finish, finish off the Australian summer um, with the trophy. Who are some of their players that you really have to look out for? Uh, well, yeah, Soph Devine, um, Leah Tahuhu as well, who played um, WBBL. <laughs> um, yeah, look, I think, you know, they've got young leg spinner in, um, in Kerr too. So they've, they've got some really good depth within their team um, and some dangerous players too. So, yeah, we certainly don't want to underestimate them um, because they can be match winners on their day. Yeah, look, there's plenty of health, healthy banter uh, between the two sides, I think, with the the WBBL being able to play alongside a lot of these girls has been it's been fantastic I think the quality of cricket has helped the international game but as well playing alongside your mates it sort of makes for some interesting conversations out on the field. They just mentioned you haven't won this series in a while how much is that fire in the belly for you guys? Yeah look I think it's come up 20 years now and, and we're pretty keen to to grab that trophy back, I think we've been very close in the past and that's something that we're really holding on to. And as well, we're coming off the back of a bit of momentum against the Indian side, who are a quality side. So we've played a lot of cricket together over the last couple of weeks and I think that's going to hold us in really good stead. After losing the ODIs to India, what did the team sort of work on or turn around to then clean sweep the T20s? Yeah, look, we were pretty, pretty disappointed um, with the way we started that series, especially being at home. We wanted to really put a mark on that and it probably took us a little bit too long to kick into gear. We spoke a lot about our planning and preparation against the Indian side, which carried a lot of spinners, and we were probably a little bit slow to pick up on that, but I think once we got that right, I think, as you saw with the results, we sort of seemed to steamroll a little bit, so for us it's about making sure we're as prepared as possible coming into the series.